Truly Mad Plastics has released their new FDA compliant edible metallic highlighters and it comes in copper, silver, gold, and rose gold. So I'm just going to do a quick tutorial of how I mix it for airbrushing and compare it to their old non-toxic metallic colors. So I'm going to start with gold and I will do a comparison of the other colors in a different video. So this is the FGA compliant gold highlighter and this is the old non-toxic gold highlighter. So what I do is I usually just take a scoop of the powder and I'll be mixing it with Ever Everclear grain alcohol. This is not available in all states so it just depends upon where you live if you're available to get it. So I'm putting a lot of Everclear in here. If I was mixing this to paint with, I would not put that much liquid in, but since it's going in my airbrush, I put more than normal. So I'm just gonna mix it up really good. And you can tell just visually that they're very different. The uh, FDA one is much more yellow. So I'm just going to be pouring both of these into my airbrush machine. And we're going to start with the FDA approved. So, so far it's spraying on beautifully. Sorry, I got a little bit too close on that last spray. But it definitely has a shine and it goes on really nice with good coverage. And then this will be the non-toxic metallic. And again, airbrushes very nicely, but it does have a completely different tone than the FDA one. But I think they both look great. Um, the FDA one definitely does have more yellow in it, but they're both shiny and both give that metallic look.